Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another review slash breakdown video here. So we're going to be reviewing the Kansas City beatdown here. 35-9, to they get the win over the Jets. A really impressive one to me. Because, I, let's just start off. I feel like their offense hadn't been clicking. I mean, I know they've been trying to get their run game going. Been going a little bit heavy there. But I just felt like the pass game, just it just was just off just a little bit. Just a little bit. But, man, this week, they got that going real good. I mean, they got that back, and, and I, maybe even better. I mean, Jesus, Mahomes went 31 of 42, 416 yards, five touchdowns, no picks. So, he's off to a amazing start. I mean, it... There's nobody that can say this doesn't vault him right back in the MVP conversation. I mean, he's sitting at 21 touchdowns to one interception on the year. I mean, that's an NFL record. I, I seen the closest one, I think, was somebody that had 20 and one. So Mahomes is, I mean, he's just breaking his own record there. I mean, wouldn't that be insane if he just ended the year with one pick? Um, But yeah, he's not turning the football over. He had a huge game, five touchdowns, ripped the Jets' defense apart. I know it's the Jets, but uh, it's a good look for Kansas City, especially after their passing offense. I mean, it, it, it wasn't bad. It just wasn't what we had been used to seeing, but my goodness, it, they got back to it. Then Mahomes, I mean, he just made plays. He made one play. I was talking to Matt in one of my uh, video comments. Yeah, I mean, he made this play going to the left. I mean... Damn, he, he was almost out of bounds. It was the left hash, and he was literally almost out of bounds. Threw across the body to, I think it was Byron Pringle. And, man, it was a nasty, just nasty play. Across his body, just, he, he was making plays all day yesterday. Then he did the underhand flip. I love that play they've added in. When they get close to the goal line, because it's, it's incredibly tough to defend. When you're looking at it, it looks like Mahomes just rolling out like they normally would. When you hike the ball from shotgun and sometimes, you know, when you start scrambling right, that's what it looks like until Mahomes just underhands it. And that was nasty with freaking Travis hitting a dunk on the uh, crossbar there. But offense is rolling. Offense is rolling. Might have not rush for a whole lot of yards. Um, but that's just showing you Kansas City can do it anyway. I mean, what's it been the last couple weeks? They've ran the ball, played good defense on special teams. This week... Offense was on fire passing. Run game didn't have to do as much. Defense played really good. I mean, the defense is playing very good. Just, they've allowed 21 time this year, and it was the one game they lost to the Raiders. I can't wait. I can't wait for that game, dude. I want that revenge. That's all I know. So, yeah, held Sam Darnold down. 18 of 30. He only had for 130. Um, they didn't have many rush yards. I mean, as a whole, I'm just really impressed with Kansas City. Again, they're just showing you on all three phases of the game, offense, defense, special teams, they're doing it all right. They're doing it all right. I mean, they had a fake punt that set them up for a touchdown, which was crazy because the announcer literally called it as the fake punt was happening, which was a little wild. But, um, yeah, Patrick Mahomes is just ripping right now, dude. He's ripping. Travis Kelsey had 100 yards, a touchdown. Tyreek had two touchdowns, nearly 100 yards. McCole Hardman, this is the theme I'm seeing here. McCole Hardman, nearly 100 yards, a touchdown. Mahomes is just spreading the ball out so well to every playmaker. I mean, you got Kelsey, eight receptions. Tyreek Hill, seven receptions. McCole Hardman, seven receptions. Actually, Tyreek Hill, four receptions, excuse me. McCole Hardman, seven receptions. DeMarcus, four. I mean, DeMarcus had a nasty grab in the end zone as well. So he's really spreading it out to the playmakers, which I like. Because, I mean, you kind of see on some teams when well, there's so much talent. Like, I, I kind of felt like the Browns fell in that category when they had OBJ. I just felt like Baker would force it a lot. I feel like that's the difference Mahomes has taken in his third year. He, he just spreads it out to the playmakers so good. Like, everybody who's good is going to get their touches. There's no need to worry about that. He's really good at spreading it out there. Um... Love, they're starting to bring back that creativity again with Kansas City. I mean, it never went away, but I felt like they went a bit shotgun heavy. Like, here, let's just let Mahomes get the ball, throw it 50 yards, and just take what's there. I feel like they're kind of bringing back in the trick element where they're doing end rounds, shovel passes again, which I like. I, I really like. I like the creativity. I think it makes them even more difficult to defend. Um, 
yeah, it was, a, it was a good game. I mean, there's not much I can say bad about the Chiefs. They really played well everywhere. Defense played good. Offense played incredible. See, they're deep. I mean, defense did just good. I mean, they just played well. Did what they were supposed to do. Didn't allow too much. I mean, this is one of the... I, I, I honestly felt like... I know it's the Chiefs. I felt like this could have been one of those trap games had you been underestimating a winless team. I mean, you never know, but Kansas City definitely didn't, which I like. And if you look at their schedule, it's not the roughest. I mean, they've already got out of the way Baltimore. They do play Tampa a little bit later in the year, as well as New Orleans. Those are going to be some nice games. But for right now, they play Carolina next week. Then they play Oak. They play the Vegas Raiders. So, yeah, we'll see what happens there. Definitely like what they've been doing everywhere. Offense, defense, special teams. That was a great team win. And... Let me know if you guys think that puts Mahomes right back in the MVP race. I think it has to. I think anybody that is 20, I mean, I, I, I'm not even being biased here. Anybody that has 21 touchdowns to one pick, they got to be in the race. They got to be up in that race. I mean, he's having a great year. Really starting to heat up now, Mahomes is. So I think, he, I think he's just going to continue to heat up as the year goes on here. Let me know what you guys thought of the game and if you think that vaults Mahomes back in the MVP race, because I sure do. So let me know your thoughts down in the comments section below. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.